Evening after months of back and forth about free bus fares on city buses, one proposal finally came to a vote, but it is still a long way from free fares across the board. It's been a hot topic since last year when the zero fare pilot program began. Now counselors have agreed on a step toward free fares for all that also addresses security concerns citywide. News 13's Marilyn Upchurch has more. City leaders voted on an ordinance that eliminates fares on art routes and Sunbound paratransit only. Proponents say it's a step in the right direction, especially for those who depend on the sun vans. I just wanted to say that um, zero fares uh, is a big opportunity for people with disabilities such as myself to be able to get around places easier. Uh, I, that means I don't have to depend on anyone. The Zero Fares pilot program started at the beginning of last year. For months, counselors have debated whether to end the program early over concerns about safety on city buses. But supporters argued reinstating the fares would affect the most vulnerable riders. Instead, counselors agreed to keep the program for now, but ramp up security. This ordinance does that by giving security officers more authority to enforce rules on buses and make it a specific crime to disobey them. Today, local leaders agreed more needs to be done to protect security officers and make sure they have the proper training. Pretty much everything we're doing on the transit central corridor, we're not trained for, we're not equipped for. It's not because the officers don't wanna do it. It's because of the lack of training we've been given over the years. The ordinance also makes art buses and sun vans permanently free to anyone. Even after the pilot program ends this summer, art primarily runs along the central corridor and to uptown. Counselors say they will continue working on how to expand zero fares to all the buses by then and more ways to make the buses safer. Back to you. All right, thank you, Marilyn. City officials say not collecting fares on sun vans and ART buses will cost the city about $1 million a year in fare revenue, but that's just a fraction of the $12 million it costs to run those two systems combined.